In this video, I'm going to show you how you can file a PDF on Gumroad. I'm going to walk you through start to finish. So join me and follow this tutorial. Okay, so we're going to start from the very beginning here. I'm going to create an account with you live on video. I'll upload the PDF that I'm selling and we'll build out the store. I'll also show you then how you can accept payments and how you can start making money. So go to Gumroad, click start selling. From here, you can go ahead and sign up with any of these socials, or you can enter in your email here. Once you've signed up, you will then taken to the Gumroad dashboard. From here, we can go ahead and view all of these achievements. You can show less if you want to get rid of them. And what you want to do is you want to go ahead and create your first product. We can then go to the payout section. We can set up the banking and the payout section later. But first, I will customize your product page and make that good and ready to sell. So click create your first product. It's then going to take you to this window where we can go ahead and choose what we're trying to sell. If you have a digital product, of course, you can choose this. But if you just want to offer an ebook, it is simpler if you just choose this. Now, for me, I'm going to sell a contract here for social media. This is just going to be a social media contract template. So I'm going to put here social media management contract template. Now, this is going to be aimed at people who want to start managing creators on social media, want to take a cut of their earnings, but you can sell any PDF or any ebook idea that you have. Now, for me, I'm going to actually choose digital product because if I choose ebook here, it isn't really an ebook, it is a PDF, but it doesn't really matter which you choose. I'm going to go for digital product as long as it's one of the two. Just choose which one most aligns with you. So I'm going to go for digital product. And then we can go ahead and set the price. Now, this doesn't matter because we're going to upload the product file anyway. So I'm going to put the price at $100. And what we can do next is we can go to the top. We can go next, customize. Now we're in the product page window. Now, well, the first thing I would do is go to content and you can enter the content you want to sell. Now, people get confused here because they're like, where is the upload button? The upload button is here. Click upload files. Go computer files. Here you can then open up your file explorer. Choose the file that you want to sell. Obviously, I'm choosing this social media contract. And now that has been uploaded. This will then be sent to the recipient when they go ahead and buy it. So you can see it down here, social media management template. We'll go ahead and click save changes. Then we'll go back to the product page. Now from here, you want to be very descriptive about your product, what it is, and how it can help the person who's looking at it, you've got to put yourself in the eyes of the potential customer here because they're not going to buy if you don't describe what it is, if you don't show what it is, if you don't explain what it is. You can use ChatGPT to help you do this. You can also insert images and if you've got videos of the product, you can do that as well. So I've gone ahead and opened up ChatGPT and I've asked it to create me an overview. So this may be good for you. You can refine this. I'm going to put here, make it more sellable. Obviously not the greatest prompt in the world, but this will do for the video. So we will go ahead and copy this and I'll paste it in here. And as you can see, the preview and the actual sales page is looking better. We would add images to this to make it more sellable. Then go to the URL. This will be your username.gumroad.com. You can add a custom domain later if you need to. And I'm going to put here social media template. OK, so now we've done that, we can upload a cover image. Now, this is going to go straight at the top. So again, I can ask ChatGPT to do this. I can go ahead and create it on Canva. I can take a photo. I can edit it in Photoshop. It really doesn't matter, but it does need to be at least 1280 by 720. So I've asked ChatGPT to create my cover image. Again, you can go ahead and create it yourself. But just for the quickness of the tutorial, I'm going to download this one. And we'll go upload images, computer files, and we'll go ahead and add it from ChatGPT. And there you go. It now adds this to your product page. So as you can see, even with these really bad ChatGPT graphics and description, it's starting to come together. And as a potential buyer, you'll be more likely to go and buy this if it didn't have anything there. Then you can change the call to action. I'm going to put here buy this. And then you want a summary. So I could put here a social media contract that will help you sign creators and make money. OK, so now we've got that summary. We can go ahead and add additional details if needed. You can click add details and you can just kind of like 
basically add more information to sell the potential customer. You can then choose your integrations. I'm going to leave this as it is. Choose the amount. You can allow installments if you want to as well, if you're offering a high ticket product. And then you can go ahead and scroll down even more and enter in a custom domain if you have one, if you want to connect one. Once you're done with this, scroll up to the top, click save and continue. And then the changes will be saved. You can then click publish and continue. And make sure you need to confirm your email address before you do this. So with the email confirmed and verified, it's now going to tell you you must connect at least one payment method. So to do that, just go ahead and save the changes. It's going to save it to the products page. So here it is. You can see it is currently unpublished. Now what we can do is we can go to settings. We can go to payments. We can then choose where we're located. Then once you have been verified here, you can choose your payout schedule add any PayPal account that you may have, as well as any bank account if you have that as well. This is going to be different though, depending on what country you choose. But once you've added your payment details here, you will then be able to go back to products. Then you see the product that you've just worked on. You can go ahead and click on it. You can then click save and continue and it will publish it once you click publish and continue. Then you'll be able to find your URL in the products section. Here, this URL will be working, it will be live. People will then be able to buy your product and the payment will then go into Gumroad and you'll be able to then take the payment out using the payments that you set up in the payment section. So I hope that video was helpful. Let me know in the comment section below if it was.